All right, according to a writer at the liberal blog Slate, you are a bad person if you send your children to private school. I know it's surprising to hear a lib label you bad for not agreeing with them, but hear her out. Allison Benedict says you must put your kids in public education, for then our shared suffering will force an improvement in the schools. It could take generations, she says, and for a while your kids are going to suffer, but it's totally worth it for the common good. And what about parents who send their kids to private schools for religious reasons or because their kids have behavioral issues? Benedict says that's not a compelling reason. And so we witness once again the spirit of the leafy campus. Preach tolerance, but only for their ideas. What she left out? Compliance. What if you don't want to do what she says? The phrase common good has allowed for some really awful people to make good people do things against their will. It's called fascism. Once government takes over, bad becomes acceptable, and it never gets better until you're dead. Without the engine of competition, all roads to hell are paved with clones for the common good. But I can forgive this writer. For she claims she had a terrible public education. So her ridiculous article is gold-plated proof of the results of a bad public school. I wonder how many people enrolled their kids in private after reading it. <laughs>